okay now uh, let's go to the immediate expiry 30th of jan let's look at this call option in fact let's not take 26th of feb a call option with 6200 okay so let me write down the specifics 6200 is a call option spot price we saw was 6266 which is here now if i this is a call option which means i have a right to buy at 6200 if i buy today how much profit am i earning 66 okay but let's look at at what price this option is trading this option is trading at a price of 177 so premium of this option is 177 so what do you see this premium is actually made of two parts one is the 66 that if i exercise today okay if i was allowed to exercise today then the benefit i would have had was 66 But the price is one seventy seven, which means there is one 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 extra here, isn't it? That price is extra by triple one. This extra price of an option is called the time value of the option. And if I exercise today, the immediate benefit that I'll have, this is called as intrinsic value of the option. Are you clear with this? The question is that why are people willing to pay this extra one one one? people are paying this extra 111 because as of now this is 6266 the expiry is 26th of feb there is a possibility that by then nifty might be let's say 7000 okay that's unrealistic but let's say 6700 6600 if it reaches there then i will all earn substantial amount so because there is a possibility of making profit i'm willing to pay something extra so that extra that you pay is called time value at times we call that extra amount also as speculative value of the option so the premium of option is made of two parts number one is intrinsic value number two is time value or speculative value meaning of intrinsic value is if i exercise today how much benefit will i have and whatever i am paying over and above that is simply called as speculative value or time value let's do one more example it's a call option strike price is 100 let's say currently spot price is 150 option is trading at a price of 70 rupees if i exercise today how much benefit will i have 50 so that 50 rupees would be called as intrinsic value of the option But it is trading at seventy, so that twenty rupees is called as time value of the option. Are we clear? One more example. Again, a call option. Strike price hundred. Spot price ninety-five. Premium twenty-five rupees. Again, this is made of two parts. If I exercise today, how much will I earn? i will not earn anything so if i am not earning anything will i exercise no so intrinsic value is never negative the lowest intrinsic value is zero so intrinsic value zero so entire value of the option is time value which is 25 is the logic clear next ha huh? speculative value perfect perfect only the options which are in the money have a intrinsic value good next let's look at a put option strike price is 100 spot price is 70 premium is 40 if i exercise today i have a right to sell at 100 how much will i earn 30 that 30 is called time value sorry yes intrinsic value how about that extra 10 that's the time value or speculative value are we good to move further last example again a put option strike price 100 spot price 150 premium 15 if i exercise today how much will i earn 
zero. I want exercise, so zero. So this is my intrinsic value, and the entire amount of fifteen is my time value. Are we clear?